recording myself. <laughs> You're watching Hollywood Today Live Digital Edition. You can tweet us at official HTL, like us on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, whatever. You know the deal. Just do all that stuff. Yes, please. Hey, he's Hyla. I'm Amy Paprath. Our next guest today is apparently into all things dark, whether yes. it's vampires and werewolves on the CW's The Originals, or drug dealers and kidnappers in A Walk Among the Tombstones out Friday. What's going on, man? Welcome, Sebastian Roche. Thank you so much. I'm very glad to be here. Comment ça va? Ça va, ça va très bien. Et toi, tu parles français? Uh, un peu de français. <laughs> ah, oui, il parle un peu. Let's just stop Aww. it right there. Et toi, Amy? Nine. Amy, she's like, nine. Nine. I don't <laughs> speak French. Tu parles Deutsch? Tu parles Deutsch? I speak, I speak Deutsch. Five. I speak right. Italian too. Possiamo parlare italiano. Okay. Yeah. Now he's just showing off. Yeah, I am. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Are you in a relationship? Oh, you're married. I am, yes, I Are am. You in really show off, I am in, right? in a relationship forever. Forever. <laughs> yeah, it sealed the deal. At least that's what she says. It was the five languages that did it, right? When you can I'm, say I'm, I love I'm you twisting. in five languages, it's I know. Fun. Oh, yeah, yeah. You can I take can. a spin if you want. And I can say it now in, 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 um, in Korean, because she's of Korean origin. I mean, she's Australian. You're right. She's the most Australian Korean you'll ever meet. But I can say, she's like, good eye, Mike. No, no, she doesn't sound like that. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. She'd be like, how on the dare back. you portray me like that? <laughs> that's not camera. a knife. This is a knife. <laughs> yeah, that's not a knife. <laughs> that's one of my favorites. Yeah, you, so, uh, uh, I love you in Korean is saranghae. It's beautiful, isn't it? Saranghae. Yeah. Sorry, I love it. Saranghae. <laughs> nice. All right, Tombstone. Let's yes. start with that. Um, a walk among. A walk among the, the tombstones. tombstones. Yes. Liam Neeson. Um, yes. yes. Uh, Liam Neeson is a wonderful guy. <laughs> I was going to ask you about your impression. <laughs> you do these Liam impressions. Have yeah. you ever done it to him? Uh, in, 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 like, in no, no, I didn't do it to Liam. I, I, was, I was like, Liam. I want to hear the I taken one. Hey, how are you, Sebastian? You're fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to find you. Yeah, yeah, there he is. There's a phone, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, no, that's a girl. Well, they oh, yeah. need voice dubbing and they this can't fall. get him. You're the guy. <laughs> this fall, I'm pushing through the door. Oh, photos, <laughs> dirty photos. <laughs> There's a guy behind me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's, from, he's from Iceland. I'm looking at you with smoldering eyes. And they were walking among the tombstones. I'm, the, I'm at the back there. I tripped at one point. <laughs> I tripped on a tombstone. They I, get, they, I keep. Oh look, that's me in this in the slow mo. Yeah, look, look. Oh, right there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we got you. Uh, so working with yes. Liam, he's like awesome. He's, Everyone uh, says it's like super fun to work with. He's that guy. he's amazing. I mean, yeah. he truly. You know, he's one of these. He's a prince of a man. You know, he's he's this fabulous gentleman, down to earth, totally approachable. You can talk about. And he's kind of there. found his lane, right? He's just this guy. Don't yeah. Don't have kids, or I'm going to kick your ass. Yeah, exactly. But I mean, this this is a little more complex. You know, it's it's a it's a far more complex. I mean, it is in in that vein, but it's a very, it's more a throwback to the sort of 70s psychological film noir action thriller. You know, mm -hmm. sets truly set in in New York. You know, which is rare nowadays. So you know, you shoot you know London for for. LA now, right, pretty exactly. much. <laughs> or, you know, or New Orleans for LA because there's tax, more tax man. incentives. Yeah. Thank you, Jerry Brown. <laughs> Thank you, Jerry Brown. We're actually going to be able to work here. Yeah. Uh, but because, uh, you know, I basically never work you in LA. Never do. No, yeah, you're in Atlanta do. with the originals. Atlanta or, you know, Ooh. Supernatural in Vancouver. I thought it was super interesting to learn that as a kid you lived on a boat. Yes, I did, yeah. Like, I lived, I lived. Like your parents were just like awesome sailor hippies, or what was? They were. On? I mean, they were not hippies at all. Actually, you know, they came from. They were very sort of more Downton Abbey. -esque. They were like, <laughs> let's sell everything, Wait, and go on a boat. Upstairs. The no, they were upstairs. Oh, upstairs. They were upstairs. Abbey, downtown, yeah. After the boat, we were downstairs. Of <laughs> right. But uh, no, no, we, we basically. Yeah, my dad. No, my dad was in the corporate world, and he he said, you know, I never see my my kids anymore. So. He sold the house, bought a sailing boat, and we took off. I was 12 at the time. That's so amazing. So from the age of 12 to 18, I was like, Oh my you gosh, know, six years. Six years. Where did you go? All over the world? No, not all over. I mean, we went from France pretty much to the whole Mediterranean, west coast of Africa. We crossed the Atlantic to the Caribbean and South America. So we, I, you know, I lived mostly, I'm spinning back. <laughs> so we lived. We have we a guy who controls it, just goes left, right. So, so um, no, it was mostly the Caribbean and, and South America. Did you go to Panama? No, no, never. There were a lot of sailors. I, I just shot something down there. And oh, you did? I hear it's gorgeous. Of, yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd love to go to Panama. What and do you we'll, learn I will as go a to... kid who's 12, 13, 14, and just hanging out in ports around the world? My God, you learned so much. I mean, you know, because uh, I was doing home, I was homeschooled pretty much. 
And uh, I read extensively because there was no internet, nothing of that. We didn't even have a TV on board. We barely had, we didn't even have hot water on the boat. Do My dad was like, oh, we're going to build a boat for the Caribbean. It's going to be wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> and then we would literally, you'd have to press on a pedal for the shower, oh. you know. And also, you have so to it wasn't pump as out for as the loo. Expected. It wasn't glamorous, but for us, it was, it was you know, an adventure. Yeah, as a kid, you. you what know, about like you know, you're, like you're sort of teenage you, love? Yeah, did you miss out on teenage love? Bloody hell, you'd be like, eh, I love you on the boat. This is <laughs> like, love. See you in the next port. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty much that. <laughs> Needless to say, when I turned 18 in the Virgin Islands, I was quite ah. ravenous. This it's where I, <laughs> you had a lot of I was like, it's where it's actually it. it's where I lost my virginity. It's true. Vinny. It's a true story. I lost my virginity on a story. boat in the Virgin <laughs> Islands. Nice. It didn't last long the first time, but of course. Sorry, not. sorry for these Who's details. Who does? No. How and do I was listening to. How, do you, how does this go down? What? How did it go down? Yeah. The I girl was it. like, you're you're cute. <laughs> And I was like, okay. <laughs> so it sounded like some like rich. She assaulted me. She was yeah. Uh, on no. vacation with her parents. She was from New Rochelle. I remember her name, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna quote it on TV. Was Poor it her first gonna be like, as well? Oh shit! It was me. It was her first time as well. No, no, it was. Oh no, it she wasn't was her first time. No, she was like. <laughs> no, she was yeah. 50 years old. She knew exactly what she was she, doing. No, she and was in her oh. 20s. She was like from New Rochelle, New York. She was like you. <laughs> but of course, you know, after after once. You know, for the first time, she was like, see ya. Yeah, that's enough. <laughs> Since then, I am way better. <laughs> OK, so you're balancing. <laughs> <laughs> it's improved a lot. Since we'll then. ask your wife I was about 17 that. and a half. We, we know that we can see you in Walk Amongst the Tombstones. Walk Among the Tombstones. Yes. Uh, where you, can we see that's you That's out this screen? weekend? September yeah, that's, this, is on, uh, this comes out this Friday. Yes. Yeah. And it's a, it's a really good film. I mean, I saw it. It's very dark and 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 atmospheric, and it's it's a really wonderful film, I think. But beautifully for, shot you know, and beautifully a, directed. There's a group of us that are lazy and don't want to yes. go to the theater, so we can turn on the TV. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, no, but you have to go to the theater and, and, and to the movie theater. It's it's a much better I experience. I love the theater experience. Yes, come you on. You see a lot of movies in the theater. Don't it's let this fabulous. guy fool you. Come on. Of course. It is, there's yes, nothing like it. But if you want to turn on the TV, yes. October 6th, there we on go. Monday, there we go. <laughs> on the CW, which stands for... C and W, and um, <laughs> no. I've always wondered Sorry, what I'm it just, stands for. Uh, you, you can watch the originals, and the, I have to admit, I this season of the originals, uh, you can yeah. see, promises to. I mean, it's going to be an extraordinary, truly extraordinary season. It, 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 you know, they they sort of introduce it as a sort of gothic, dark gothic tale with Shakespearean undertones, and it really is that. I mean. Uh, the the, fun, the family dynamic is going to be quite quite extraordinary, I think. And it sounds like sort of a dream job for you coming from that. It is, yeah, yeah. Background. It it really is because the character, you know, is is this sort of hyperhuman character who's a thousand years old and lived in the Viking times, and you know, is is this sort of I I I sort of refer him as a volcano about to erupt. You know, he's been on this quest for vengeance for a thousand years, and he carries. This, this rage and history with him, you know, and, and it's, it's actually one of the most challenging roles that I've ever had, you know, because you can play the bad guy, but he requires so much energy because he hates so fiercely, and I, and, but, uh, you know, there will be also undertones of, of, of emotion, and that Very because, complex. you know, rage comes from emotion, from right. pain, you know, so. Now, yeah, I'm it, not an actor, but I'd like to think that. But I play one on TV. But I play one on TV. <laughs> Uh, forget all the accolades. Yes. Uh, you know, uh, Emmys. Uh, no, no, I've Oscars, never, I've blah, never blah, gotten blah. an award. <laughs> no, I'm saying like the real reason you get into acting is so you can do awesome sci-fi. Yes, I mean, look, look, you know, come on, I'm pulling out two hearts there. Look. Yeah, you just ripped out two hearts. I just ripped out two <laughs> like, hearts. That's look, why. Yeah. I cut myself shaving. And then, <laughs> yeah, look, yeah, there you go. Like that. It's look, so much he's fun. like. Look, Oh, you see, see, we can we can rip French open you. bottles. We that's can do. Not so very French of you. No, it's not very French. Have you seen the but YouTube video where you can open up the bottle with a shoe? No, that's I've done it. The wine bottle. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it really? works. You've done, done it. Yeah, with a shoe. Desperate times it, it, call for desperate measures. Yeah, you just go. <laughs> you yeah. just crash it against. Yeah, my, it. That video might be banned in France. I use a sword. <laughs> yes. You know, it's called sablé le champagne. You take the sword, you rub it. I'm not being sexual, but you rub it, and then you cut it open. Sorry. 
We have learned a lot here. <laughs> yeah. Miss Sebastian Roche. We want to thank you so much for coming you. in. Thank you. Thank you. The pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.